do share and subscribe for more such videos on software testing hello everyone my name is rahul and welcome to my channel rahul kiwa labs so in today's tutorial we will be seeing uh, what is test case studio so uh, test case studio is the latest uh, invention uh, uh, by mr sanjay and um, uh, it is uh, you know uh, it is an extension uh, which helps you uh, to record the user actions uh, for web application and uh, uh, give that in the simple English version. So uh, these are some of the features that are listed out here. So uh, it will help you to generate the XPath CSS selector and automation code for every action. Uh, it is a free browser plugin and it is very simple to use. We can save these uh, steps in the form of a test case. So you can download all these steps and um, uh, you can uh, save it in the form of a test case. And uh, it helps you to save a lot of time. So instead of writing manually all the test cases, uh, you can perform the action. So all the steps will be recorded uh, by the test case studio and you can download that into an Excel file. And the last point is it is absolutely safe uh, and secure. So uh, let's see how uh, we can install test case studio and then we will try to uh, you know uh, record a simple uh, test case for login okay so for downloading uh, the test case studio uh, let us go to Google and you type here selectors hub okay so go to the website this is the website for uh, selectors hub selectors hub.com and here you will find a link test case studio okay so uh, this test case studio is uh, available as an extension and these are the different browsers that are present out here which it supports okay so uh, we will uh, select the chrome extension and it will take you to the chrome web store uh, where you will find uh, uh, the extension so you need to click on add to chrome and uh, let's try to add it so it will ask you uh, to add the extension click on add extension okay so test case studio has been added to the chrome so use this extension by clicking on this icon and manage your extensions by clicking extensions in the tools menu so uh, if you go here so here you will be able to see the test case studio extension and uh, it says that it records the user actions performed on a web application in english sentence so um, that is how you can uh, add test case studio to the chrome uh, now let's uh, try to record test case simple test case uh, for our uh, uh, recording we will use a website orange hrm so this is the url of the website i will mention it uh, in the description of the video as well okay so now uh, before starting you have to click on that extension go here and click on test case studio okay so you will get a window so this window and it says that click to stop recording so that means the recording has already started now uh, we will perform the steps okay so this is the website uh, and we will try to log in so uh, the username and password are present out here so write the user id and give the password and then click on login so uh, when you click on login so this will be the dashboard so um, you can see different options are present here and uh, we have logged in successfully so that's just a basic simple uh, test case we have created now we will go back to our uh, uh, test case studio so these are all the steps what we will do is uh, we will click on stop recording okay so the recording has stopped it has recorded all the steps uh, with all the data that uh, we have given now uh, as i uh, said that you can download this test case into an excel format as well so here is a button out here click on download test case uh, 
and it will be downloaded open source demo.csv so it will download a csv file let's open that file and see what is there in that okay so this is the file and uh, it has uh, you know five uh, columns out here steps data uh, expected result xpath and css selector okay so whatever we did on that particular website it has listed down here so open the website what is the uh, name or the url of the website open source demo dot orange live dot com and then click on username enter in the text so we enter admin then enter in the password we clicked on submit or login so it has logged in successfully so this is a simple demonstration of uh, the steps out here that uh, you can see so this is how uh, you can utilize test case studio it is a very uh, good uh, tool and it is uh, becoming popular day by day uh, let's try to uh, do uh, or record some other steps so what i will do is i'll go to my website and what we will do here is we will uh, go to contact and we will uh, try to put a message out there and click on submit so uh, again we'll go here and we will you know clear all the recorded steps because we are doing a new recording and click on start recording so the recording has started now this is the website we will go on contact the contact page will come now uh, you know send us a message you can uh, uh, fill out the name uh, you can uh, write the email id and you can give some uh, demo website like whichever website and you can give some message here okay, studio sample test okay so we have given all the fields out here now we'll click on submit okay so the message has been sent it says here the message sent and these are all the details again we'll go to uh, test case studio and we will click on stop recording so see here now these are all the steps that are recorded so we open the website we clicked on contact then we entered in name what name this is the name we entered in email this is the email id and enter in website we clicked on the website then um, click on message test case studio sample test and then we clicked on submit so these are all the steps they here you will find all the x path for uh, all the elements that we have clicked, clicked and this is the CSS selectors so same th again you can download the test case and when you open you will find all the steps out here okay so uh, the tool makes our lives easier by uh, writing down all the steps into an excel file and now we can just copy paste and utilize them into our projects okay so uh, this is a uh, all for today's video so thank you very much guys for watching my video and if you like the video uh, do subscribe my channel and for any doubts put out a comment and i'll be happy to help you thank you bye bye